good morning guys today is a good day do you know why because three things one my quarantine has finished i've been in this house for 10 days i am ready to go out and just go for a walk and get some fresh air it's good for your mental health and yeah i can't wait to step outside of the house today number two it is the 1st of February today, which means it is my birthday month. I am turning 30 on the 23rd of February, so I've got 23 days. Some people hate getting a year older. I'll probably be like that when I'm hitting my 50s and 60s. But for now, I am really looking forward to turning 30. And number three, probably the main important thing in this video and the most exciting thing, the day has finally come. I am heading to my parents to pick up Carter. If you have not watched my videos before, then you won't know who Carter is. He is my little chow chow. He's probably not little anymore because he's been at my parents' house for seven weeks. They've been taking care of him for me. He's had an amazing time, but I am now ready to get him back. My mum and dad will probably be pulling him by two legs. Now we're pulling him by two legs because they don't want him to leave. But yeah, I'm driving to Leicester today to pick him up. I'm super excited. I cannot wait to see him give him a cuddle even though he probably won't even know where I am anymore um but yeah Sunday as well he's coming back to this house I'm just going to stay here for our lockdown and um Sunday's relationship with him is so special she calls him um it's her best friend and every day since we've got back from our trip she walks in the kitchen and says Carter like he's not back yet a couple more days she's gone to nursery this morning and she cannot wait to get home to see him so we'll be filming her reunion with him later but i've got a bit of a drive ahead of me to go and pick him up so i'm going to get myself ready and then head on the road to go and get little man exciting let's do this So I have just arrived in my local village where I was brought up. Apologies if the camera's going everywhere, if the lighting goes bad, I've got you perched up oh, on my dashboard. So I've actually just got really emotional when I was on the motorway because I've missed Carter so much and it just, <laughs> it made me really emotional. So I started crying the thought of seeing him because it's made me really realize kind of when I was getting the dog, a lot of people had split decisions. So it was like, should you get a dog because your life apparently is like you have to give your life up a dog's your kind of best friend and i just i was in such a split decision but i ended up getting him because i felt like that was the right choice for me and this kind of time away from him has really made me realize that seven weeks away i've missed him so much i constantly facetimed um with my parents just to kind of check in on him it is like having a child so yeah it just makes me emotional that now i'm going to see him and hopefully he'll remember who i am but i'm just around the corner now i absolutely hate driving some people love it some people can drive for hours for me this is a two hour drive and i always just feel absolutely drained so i need to get in give him a big cuddle have a coffee or oh, the light a bit of backlight and um i definitely need to go to the bathroom as well but i'm just pulling down my street now so i'm going to turn this camera off because you're going to go flying across the dashboard in a minute kata 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 hello hello Hello! Hello! I missed you! Hello! Hello! God, you're so fluffy! Hello! Oh! Hello! Do you remember me? He remembers me! Come, give me a kiss! Good boy! You remember me? You're so fluffy, you definitely need a trim. Come. Yes. Did you miss me? Okay, so we're on the 1st of February and I'm now actually having my Christmas because I wasn't here for Christmas Day. So 
Yeah, it was weird opening your Christmas presents on the 1st of February, but Carter, ah, excuse me. Carter thinks they're for him. Excuse you me. think they're for you? Yeah, you <laughs> you're helping Daddy open them. Oh. Hey. Finally home. Hate driving. Hate it. Carter, how you feeling? Are you missing my mum and dad yet? I think he just wants to get in to be honest. That was a long drive. But yeah, I'm actually staying with my friend Fern for the next couple of months now. We're staying together for lockdown. I think I'll probably stay with her until my house is finished just because there's no point me and Carter being in the flat alone and we can kind of stay here and all be together. But um, yeah, Sunday's gonna be so excited to see him. So I think he needs a little rest before she gets home. So I better get him in and let him kind of settle a bit. My parents, it was so sad kind of getting him in the car and driving off because my dad has built up such a lovely bond with Carter because he's not really been working. He's become like best friends with him. My dad did actually offer me a thousand pounds for Carter and said, why don't I get a new one? But it's never gonna happen. I am not getting rid of him. I love him too much myself. But yeah, it was quite sad for my dad. So I think I'm gonna have to go back and visit as much as I can and take him home because I think he's just really settled with them within the seven weeks. But I wanna get out of this car, stretch my legs. So I'm gonna get in, let him settle a bit. And then um, I'll probably turn the camera on a little bit later when we have some playtime and when Sunday gets home from nursery. He knows, he ready. Yeah. Go! <laughs> hey, <you're> <laughs> Look how big and fluffy he is. Oh my god! He's so fluffy, isn't he? Carter! He's like getting used to his surroundings. Like, it's been so long! Carter, you're home! Oh yeah! Oh my god, Sunday's gonna love seeing you! He actually ran straight to the door, let him out the car and he just ran to the door. He's, He's like, I'm home. He remembers us. Yeah. <laughs> I think I need a nap because I'm knackered. You want to play fetch? Here we go. And now he wants playtime. Yeah. Sit. Sit. Good boy. Can you put this on there? Here she is. Who's in the kitchen? Wait. Have you Who's, missed him? Where is he? Oh, oh. Someone's excited. Carter! Wow. Well, look. Have you been excited all day? Missed him, haven't you? Carefully back, babe. 
Who's your best friend? Kata. Who's your best friend? Kata. Kata, who's your best friend? Sunu. <laughs> <laughs> Carter, what do you think? I think Carter likes it. Look at that bed! Wow! Let's sleep in it! Carter likes it! Carter, wow. look, Carter looks like he's Carter. eating the den. Wow, look at this! Carter, come on, go up for wee wees. Good morning, guys. So yesterday, just with a manic today, driving back, letting him settle, Sunday playing, and I completely forgot to finish off this vlog. So, it's morning, I'm ready for a brand new day. Carter's ready for a brand new day in his new house. Um, so I'm actually going to finish this vlog off here because everything that I'm doing today is not relevant with this video at all. I've got um, a prep for a shoot that I'm doing tomorrow and stuff. So, yeah, it's been, well, I'm going to say an amazing day, but it's actually the day after. It was an amazing day yesterday getting him back. I'm so happy to have him back. It just brings a lot of joy to the house and it keeps Sunday very occupied for a lot of time because she wants to just sit there and play watch tv with him or play with his toys and stuff so yeah hope you enjoyed today's video if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and if you are new to this channel thanks for watching don't forget to go and subscribe and i will see you probably next week with another vlog so i'll see you then